on everybody today I'm going to be installing a uh, chain kit conversion for my uh, for my 2015 Dyna Street Bob so this is what I got first of all I have to get one of these it's like the the lug nut remover that's in there for the uh, main drive, big motherfucking uh, flashlight looking thing. I bought the uh, zipper performance chain conversion kit. So here's the sprocket it's to attach to the rear wheel arcade chain. And then here's the rear, the rear sprocket. I wanted it black, I didn't know it was going to be just regular old aluminum. I might get it power coated if that's a possibility. And then I got some tools, I got my jack, and the bike. People ask me what kind of jack I have. This is a JMS All American Jack. It's a good fucking jack. And sturdy. So, uh, first things we're gonna do is uh, remove the uh, remove the tire, and then we'll go from there. It's kind of getting late already, so we'll see how much time I have. Never done this project before. Don't try this at home. This will definitely fuck up your warranty.
son of a bitch out was a pain in the ass. The uh, ball clamp or ring there. <laughs> Okay everyone, so that's where the video pretty much ended. I stopped recording just due to the fact that it was such a disaster <laughs> putting, uh, taking it apart. That one big lock nut that was, um, that's, that holds the, the primary, uh, the sprocket was impossible to take off. We were using everything. We torched it. We used an impact air gun. It was not coming off. We chiseled it off and that's how I was able to take it off. If, um, yeah, that was my main problem that was looking all over there and how do people take it off and it seems to be the same issue. It's just, it's super, super tight. We actually broke a ratchet in the process. Um, let me show you. So yeah, here's the ratchet we were using. Here's the tip. 
<laughs> it just fucking snapped. I didn't have a a uh, a breaker bar at my disposal, so this is what I was using. This guy, and we attached a long pipe to it, and uh, yeah, it was too much torque, and it just it snapped it. But uh, the bike is back together now. Uh, here's the all you get. I'm about to go out for a ride and uh, give it a good test run. I'll probably make a video of that old vlog. But uh, yeah. Oh, and I also installed these guys. I ordered the front, but I ordered the wrong part. I ordered the Sportster on accident, so I'm gonna return those and. Uh, Get those back on, probably uh, within the next week. Uh, yeah, we'll see what uh, let's see what she feels like.